Hi guys, welcome to Pagupai with China. In this video, we will talk about an interesting management concept, Pareto Principle or 80-20 rule. We will say what is Pareto Principle and we will also show you how to create a Pareto chart using Excel. Before going ahead, we expect you to subscribe our channel and click notification icon. The person in the pic is none other than Mr. Wilfred Pareto. He is the person who has invented this Pareto. He had made an observation on imbalance between wealth and population in Italy. He observed that 80% of land in Italy was owned by 20% of the population. Even this imbalance is true in today's scenario also in many of the countries. And this observation has transformed into an interesting management concept and which talks about an imbalance between the inputs and output and its relationship. 80% of the consequences comes from 20% of the causes is the Pareto principle. We should understand that this Pareto principle is an observation. It is not a law. So it is applicable in many scenarios, but may not be true in few scenarios. There are some major observations which you can talk about. In case of sales, 80% of the revenue comes from 20% of the customers. This would have been experienced by many people in their sales job. Similarly, in case of quality, 80% of rejections are due to 24% of defects. In inventory, 80% of the inventory cost is linked to 20% of the material. In procurement, 80% of spend is associated with 20% of vendors. Even this principle becomes true in case of world population. 80% of the population in today's world it belongs to 20% of the countries. But this rule, as we said before, it is not true always. When we calculate the population of India on state wise, 20% of the states contributes to only 60% of the population. So we should be very clear that this observation is true in many of the cases and it may not be true in some of the cases. Now we will move on to Excel and we will show you what is a Pareto chart, how it looks like and how to create a Pareto chart using Excel. The chart shown in this Excel file is the Pareto chart. You can see this Pareto chart gives you the actual value as well as the cumulative percentage. So it is a combination of a line chart and as well as a sorted bar chart. So here we have shown the country wise spend of a company. They are procuring material from 10 different countries. You can see the top two countries, which is 20% of their sources contributes to almost 80% of their spend. This is true in case of uh, this company spend. Now, we will show you how to create this Pareto chart. I have copy pasted the value of spend in, in a different sheet. Now we will calculate the percentage first. Value divided by sum of or total of spend. Fix the spend so that you can copy paste the formula. Once you complete the percentage calculation, just go to the second percentage calculation plus previous value and copy paste the formula down and you will get the cumulative percentage calculation. This is very simple. Now, moving ahead, select this table, go to insert. You have an option to create combo chart and select the second option. Once you put the cursor, you will get to know because 
it the line will be on secondary axis if you select the first option it will have only the primary axis so the second option will have the primary and secondary axis which is the pareto chart now we have to do some formatting you can't go ahead straight away with the uh, this kind of a chart should look better first we have to format the axis first thing is uh, the sum of the total spend is 3910 we have to make sure that the maximum value of this primary axis starts with 0 and it should end with 3910 which is the total spend once you complete that make sure the percentage has to be starts from 0 to 100 if you put 1 automatically the system calculates 200% now in pareto chart there should not be any gap width in format data series make the gap width to 0 and then select this chart line chart go to marker select automatic so you will get the values like where it intersects gets highlighted now add data table here also add data table to make a better look format the data tables put it inside end of bar and put this data values above and give a chart title name country wise spend pareto is the name i am giving no need of a legend just reduce the size so that the title and uh, the data values will not get intersect you can increase the chart size if required now for a better look what i am going to do is go to chart design and i am just giving a black background so now you can see the chart which i have shown you initially has been made in few minutes so now you would have understood how to create a pareto chart using excel in few minutes hope you have enjoyed watching this video please like click click like button do subscribe our channel if you have not subscribed share with your friends and do comment if you want to have ask any queries or questions or if you want us to post some new videos like this please do comment us and thanks for watching bye bye